right, you guys, Raging Red Bill here, and we're back with Pokemon Mega Adventure, the randomized Nuzlocke edition. All right, so this episode, this, this game has been crazy, just downright crazy. Now, we can go down, or we can go over here. I can't remember exactly where we're supposed to go, but we're going to go ahead and go both ways. And try to catch two more Pokemon. And here's our first Pokemon, which we got to catch. It's a Weedle. Not too fond of Weedles, but I'll catch it. Nonetheless, I will catch it. If I can without killing it. <laughs> nope, I killed it. Alright, well, let's head back over and go down. And we have Arbok! There's a good old Gen 1 Pokemon. Alright, juice tackle on it. It's a level 10. Alright, one more tackle should do it. Don't fridge me. Alright. Now let's throw the Pokeball. We got our buck. And we gotta get the nickname to all of our Pokemon. So let's go with um what was Speedy. And the reason why is because I used to have a snake named Speedy. We're gonna go ahead and switch out Volcano and Arbok because we need to get Speedy some levels here. And we gotta hit him with at least one potion, maybe two. Yep, two. Alright. And we might as well heal up Volcano just in case. And let's do this. Our first trainer battle of the episode! They got a Malamar. Hmm. Let's hit it with bite. Oh, come on, we got this. Oh! All right, well, that was crazy. We just caught Speedy, and now we lost Speedy. Oh, man. As you guys know, if you've been watching the series, any Pokemon that faints, they're dead. They're gone. You can't revive them. All right. Let's bring out... Volcano to finish this off. I saw that foul play again. I thought I was done for. Oh, man. He wants to learn Flame Burst. Yes, you can learn Flame Burst. Definitely. We'll get rid of crowd for Flame Burst. I'm an offensive type trainer, so... Kurt's house. I believe this is the guy that you can bring some acorns to. Yep. He turns acorns into Pokeballs. So if you find any acorns, you can bring them right here to Kurt. Go ahead and switch out Volcano and Speedy. 
because we have an experience share on uh uh vulture so it just makes sense to keep using volcano and we're gonna hit him with flame burst use our new move one shot him <laughs> I think we're about to get into a battle. Yep. <laughs> All right. Who's he got? He's got two Pokemon. Pig Knight. Raise magnitude on him. Hit him with a magnitude seven. Yeah, I knew he was a fighting type, so I figured that would have some pretty good damage to it. And Volcano gets level 16, and Vulture gets level 14. Vulture wants to learn Nasty Plot. I'm good. But we are going to go ahead and switch out the Vulture. Because he's standing out of Water type. And that's not going to be good for our fire and ground. Come on! There we go. Super Nerd Jake is done for. Just curious. Okay, he's dark and flying. For some reason I thought he was electric. Had a, uh, electric typing to him. And we are in a Nomi Town. Which we are definitely going to hit up the Pokemon Center. Not only do we need to heal our Pokemon, but we need to go ahead and get rid of... Speedy. Every time I get three Pokemon... One dies, man. I have no luck with Pokemon. The Anomi Gym has been closed for two years. All right. House of Red and Green. Snorlax. I got a very particular fan that's going to love to see that Snorlax right there. I think we were already in Route 5 on the other side of a Nomi Town, but I'm not sure. But we are going to try to catch the first Pokemon that pops up here. I did learn on my test trials of this game that during the Nuzlocke, if you can't catch a Pokemon, it'll tell you. We got the Soothe Bell. All right. And here's our Pokemon. It's a Stunfisk. All right. I think he's electric typing. Hit him with an ember, and if he survives, yep, okay. I think he's actually electric and water. I think. Oh, but well, we killed him. He's trying to get one more hit in without killing him, but we killed him anyway. All right. 
Like I told you guys in the first episode, this is my actual first Nuzlocke. So this is actually kind of exciting for me. Not only is this my first Nuzlocke, but this is my first randomized game. Oh, hello, Red Bill. I'm Brendan from Hino. How do you know my name? How? I know all trainers from Professor Oak. Um, are you my rival? Huh? Let's have a battle. Okay, I'll hear your Pokemon for the battle. Done. Battle! Time to battle! <laughs> I'm like a little kid when I play Pokemon in there. I really am. I have no idea who he is. But let's hit him with a magnitude. Looks like he's got a grass type and he should use razor teeth. Buddy, that razor leaf is not going to do much to me. <sighs> and Volcano's going to pick up a level from him. Level 17. Vulture gets level 15. And he's sending out Omnistar. I think he might have a water typing too. Oh, I guess he don't have a water typing or else ground wouldn't have been super effective. I didn't see who he's sending out. Okay. Flame burst, I believe you're skill type. Come on! Flame Burst! He's done for! Good game! But I have to get my, the second badge. See you again! Alright, well I'm gonna assume that we're on the right track, and if I'm not mistaken... Yeah, this is Pine Forest. This is a new area, so let's catch us a new Pokémon! And I'm going to go ahead and bring Vulture out. Just because he's not quite as strong as Volcano. And he might be able to weaken it without killing it. It's another Arbok! This is going to be Speedy's little brother. Alright. Let's hit him with a gust. All right, we're gonna try to catch him right there. Nope. I'm hoping this don't kill him, but we're gonna try it. All right, let's try it again. Don't kill him. Oh. Maybe eventually I'll get six Pokemon. Maybe. One day. Oh, I would have loved to have run into you. Hmm. Let's try Fury Attack. I know it doesn't do a lot of damage, 
but it does hit multiple times. Maybe. No. No. Keeps lowering our attack. Okay, come on. I ain't gonna kill him. Alright, come on. Almost. Damn. Too bad we're not trying to catch him. And actually, since we paralyzed and we couldn't move, I'll show you what it says. Red Bill threw one Pokeball. Okay, it let me. Maybe it's because we already had Narbok. Yeah, let's give you a nickname. Um... I don't even, I can't, oh, it's a boy, hang on. And with that, we got our new team member, Ice King, Vulture, and Volcano. Whoa, Magwarter. All right, we're gonna run away from you. Let's... Let's take the experience share off of you and put it on you. Let's heal up my Pokemon because they're they've all taken some hits. All right, I'm pretty sure we're almost out of here, but this episode is almost over. Yep, here we go. Koryama Town. Koryama City. My bad. The Koryama City Pokemon Center. Alright, you guys. You see Ash up there at the PC? We'll go talk to him in a minute. But for right now... That's going to be in the end of today's episode. In the next episode, we're going to talk to Ash. And then we're going to take on the Koryama City Gym. See you next time.